Hello YouTubers, welcome back to Yorkshireman 66 I am Mark, your host, the one, well, who entertains you basically And I, yeah, yeah, I suppose I do entertain, I really do Now, I've got, I said I'd do um, another video when I got the other DVD Well I've got it now, I've got the other DVD uh, from Music Magpie And yeah, I'll just say a quote from it uh, once they said God himself couldn't sink her. Now they say no man on earth could raise her. <laughs> so what could I be talking about? Well, I'm talking about this film. Raise the Titanic. From... Uh, it features music suites of the original score by John Barry. <laughs> it's basically... You know, it's to raise the Titanic. And, uh, and basically... There's a special renewable memory and things like that who, you know, desperate to reach the vital cargo. So, it's all about getting this renewable mineral off, you know, you know, you know going. <laughs> it's what gets me. It really is. I won't tell you the, the uh, switch, yeah, I won't tell you the ending of it, but it, 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 it's funny. Because to spend a lot of money. <laughs> money to do you know to yeah in the film they spend a lot of money to go do this and in reality they didn't have to do it <laughs> that's the clincher yeah. but this film was made in 1980 um i saw it it it, it, it was made 1980 high tv studios they made the thing um, it's by network um british film network british films um that's a sink the Titanic, you know, raise the Titanic. Um, so you've had, we've had the sinking of it. Now we, now we're gonna go raise them. You know what I mean? And this was done five years before they even found Titanic. I mean, I, I, everyone knows Titanic were found in 1985 by the American. Um, I'll tell you exactly who, who found it because I do have his name. And it was Robert Ballard, yeah, ocean oceanographer, yeah, Robert Ballard, the oceanographer, discovered the Titanic in 1985, and he released pictures saying that he'd done it. I think the biggest, I think the big mistake he 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 made was not to take ownership of it, because uh, he, he he didn't honestly think people would loot it, but they did. You know, some people have looted it. And that, and there she is. The fires are no nights, a protected site. Can't take anything off it now. And it, it, it is a final resting place for a lot of people. You know what I mean? Is the Titanic. But when this came out, I thought it were a unique concept, really. Um, and and there were friends of mine. Hey, I left, so I went. I went to school. I went to school the next day. I mean, I saw this on a Sunday night, and I went to school the next day. And everyone went, oh, oh yeah, they're going to raise Titanic. Oh, I, saw, I saw all this thing on it. And I thought, they're not going to raise the Titanic in real life. I told people this. Oh, you don't know what you're on about. I says, they haven't even found it yet. I says, yeah, well, the Titanic was an unknown quantity. Um, I mean, they, they wasn't too sure if it had broken out. Uh, I mean, a lot of people, I mean... You can see this through through documentaries. Um, I I haven't I've seen lots and lots of documentaries of the Titanic, and there is I I witness testimony to saying on the night the ship did break in two. Um, uh, and obviously there's other people say oh no it went down all and all this here. I mean so there's conflicting two two way stories. So they didn't really know until the founder that she she, she were in half. Yeah basically in two pieces and she was but the preservation of it is unbelievable They're slowly losing it but it's there isn't it Titanic was found you know what I mean and this film means a lot to me you know what I mean <laughs> means a lot to me you know the going on there's oh yeah the ship's still yeah, yeah it's in one piece this is how they found it in one piece <laughs> you know what I mean but uh, yeah yeah, 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 raise the Titanic. 
It's an old star cast as well. Um, it's based on Clive Cussler's best-selling novel, The Scripping Adventure, as well, and, it, and it's got Alex uh, Alex Guinness is in it. You know, it, you know, music by John Barry's outstanding scenes. Pete w Walker's in it as well, and and, and yeah. Pete Walker, he he were in uh, Equalizer as well. Um, he was Robert McCall's mate. Mm, there you go. That original trailer, PDF material, images. Yeah, Alex Guinness is in this. Fantastic. Yeah, I've got another film with Alex Guinness. In. <laughs> Fantastic actor. He really is. And that. So I thought I'd do the short video uh, on on Raise the Titanic. It came. It came on time. Well, it came early actually, <laughs> but yeah, I, I I got it yesterday, and it, it it it's come, and it's it it was sealed as well, uh, and that and and what I do like about it is I got the little booklet to go with it, and I thought yeah. Now looking at that, you won't think that were a model being being raised up out of water, would you? But it is. It's only a model. But you think it was for real. Yeah. It's a good, it's a good, good, good film. I like it. It really is. It's it's a, it's a good, it, it really is a good, it, it really is a, really is, it, it really is a great little film. And that, and, and, and this book, look, I'll, I will read it eventually and I think you can't go wrong with that you know right? tells you all about uh, you know that's how they found it yeah that's how they're supposed to have found it so there you go An underwater adventure the tight raise the tight on it and there you go dig it in there you go that's where that mineral is that's why I was laughing they didn't have to do it. <laughs> Never mind. It's a good film. If you haven't got it, get it. It, it, it is a remarkable film. I, 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 I do like it. And the attention to details. You got the John Barry biography. Yeah, you got the John Barry biography there as well. And yeah, and it, 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 it really is. It really is a, a good, a good film. I like it. I do really like it. Oh, the incredible, the incredible challenge is coming August the first at the cinema. At cinema d dome, all right. It's all there. It, it did come out into cinema. That's why I first saw it in cinema. But I also saw it on, I did see it on telly as well. Um, but all, all, all my mates have seen it and they're all there. Oh yeah, yeah, Titanic's going to get raised up and that. And I thought, well, no. Yeah. That's the disc. It's brand new. So, yeah. So yeah, there, there is, you know, I, I witnessed testimony, I mean there were predictions in, in, in I think it was 1890, there was predictions, I mean someone did remind me that there were a book where a prediction was given about this particular ship, so you know what I mean, but a lot of people, they say predictions are predictions but I'm open minded and that and if it were foreseen or all that you know people wouldn't have believed it at the time that are just as uh, yeah well obviously they didn't believe it because it still went ahead it still got built and it still sunk unfortunately but yeah it's a great little film i like it and i always remember this film from my childhood and that's why i bought it because it instantly triggers you know 1980 yeah 
I mean, I, I, I left school when I was in 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 eighty in eighty nineteen eighty. When did I leave school? I was seventeen in eighty three, sixteen in eighty two. I was supposed to leave in eighty one. I was fourteen when this came out. Um, fifteen, I was supposed to leave. Eighty two, I left. You know, roughly about eighty one, eighty two. I went to college, and that did what I had to do, and then there you go. I thought this is a great look film. A lot of people uh, say what it is all about, and and I like it. And I think, yeah, you know, to make a ten, <laughs> just over a ten minute video of one single film is good. I am going to do a video now. I don't know if you like this or not, but I am going to do a video on um, I've got yeah, you know, you know, black and white films, yeah, you know, yeah, 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 you know, what we call chronography. Yeah, you know, yeah, you know, all black and white. Chromo in it, mono colour and that. Um, you know what I mean? So, what do you prefer? Do you prefer the colour films, or do you like the black and white films? Be interesting to find out. You know what I mean? So there you go. So that's it. Really good. So yeah, I went. Yeah, if you've have, have enjoyed it and you want to see more like this, then then please, please, please like the video, subscribe, thumbs up, please subscribe. And hit the bell icon and hit all and that will let you know when I'm uploading a video. Please share the video. Share it as much as you can with Facebook, Twitter and um, your friends and family and things like that. And please comment below and uh, it will be much appreciated. And I'd like to thank all my new subscribers and all the subscribers who have stuck with me from the beginning. I do thank you. I do appreciate it very much. And I'll, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.